Hi everyone. Let's go ahead and see how you can install TensorFlow GPU on a Windows computer. You need to come here at tensorflow.org, install pip windows, otherwise you can just simply search here, install tensorflow on windows. Then you need to open here the first link, you just need to open the first link thereafter, you need to uh, hide this one and then just scroll it little down and thereafter you need to select here windows native. So in this Windows native, it says that currently TensorFlow 2.10 or after that, I mean uh, 2.10 or before that is only supported with Windows native. So with TensorFlow 2.11, it is not supported with Windows as of now. So you cannot install. So basically we have to make sure that we install our TensorFlow less than 2.11. Apart from that, you also need to make sure that you install Python 10 or less than Python 3.10. So whenever you go with Python 3.10 up more than the Python 3.10, then uh, it would again start creating a problem. So whenever if you have installed a latest version of the Anaconda, then probably you might have a, a higher version of the Python. So you have to create a new environment for your uh, Python 3.10 and then you have to install your TensorFlow and then CUDA uh, toolkit for GPU use. So here I have shown how you can install Anaconda. The link is given in this video description. From there you can watch this video, just see how you can install that. Here is the process which I'm going to show you how you can uh, install Anaconda and uh, how you can install Python 3.10 and then how you can install CUDA toolkit and the TensorFlow. In fact, the uh, Anaconda installation is given in the video and uh, uh, Python and uh, CUDA apart from that the TensorFlow installation is given in this, in this uh, uh, note here. So first of all, you need to create here a new python uh, environment so i'm gonna give a name to my python environment name as py310 thereafter you need to open here anaconda prompt you just need to search here anaconda prompt just open this anaconda prompt thereafter it will open your anaconda prompt here do not worry you need to create here first of all uh, a new environment so i'm just gonna paste that here conda create minus n py310 that's the python 3.10 and python equal to 3.10 so it's going to install python 3.10 and it's going to create a new environment it will also install all the necessary libraries needed for your python 3.10 All right. So here it is installing. It will take a while to install all these necessary packages here. We have to wait for some time. So seems like it has installed all these necessary packages. Now we can activate our Konda package here. So you just need to copy Konda, activate py310. Uh, so I just write here Konda, activate python310. So Python 3.10 is now activated. Once Python 3.10 is activated, thereafter you need to install CUDA Toolkit 11.2 and QDNN 8.1.0. So I'm just going to copy this whole thing from here and then I'm going to paste it here. All right. So this thing is going to install CUDA Toolkit and QDNN in your computer under PY 3.10 environment. So do remember whenever you need to use your GPU and TensorFlow, you have to make sure that you activate your you, you, you activate your environment PY310. So that you can activate with Konda activate PY310. It will take a while to install all these necessary libraries. Thereafter, we will follow here our other steps like Python install TensorFlow. So this will also take a while to install. So let's wait for some time and let it finish first. It has asked me whether you want to proceed or not. Yes, definitely I want to install all the NVIDIA necessary packages in my PC. 
so it has successfully installed this so nvidia packages are installed now we are ready to install here tensorflow you just need to copy this and then paste it here depending on your internet speed and computer speed it might take some time to install nvidia packages and tensorflow because it downloads these uh, uh, softwares from the internet so obviously depending on internet speed it may take some time at your computer so installation is getting done here it has downloaded all the necessary packages which is really quite fast uh, because my internet speed is really super fast so it took it took like 10 to 20 seconds for me to only install all these packages here once all these packages are installed then we are going to run our python and then we will be testing whether our gpu is working or not all right so in background you can see that it has successfully installed all the necessary packages now we are ready to run this code to test if our if our gpu is working with tensorflow or not so you need to just write here python and thereafter you just need to paste that here import tensorflow as tf so this is first time so it will take some time to import tensorflow all right we are still waiting here now you can clearly see here as soon as i run here this command tf.config.list physical devices it is saying that there is one gpu available to my computer otherwise you can simply write here tf.test.isgpu available you just paste it here and then if you run this it says that true that's me nvidia geforce rtx 2060 uh, uh, gpu is available to my pc so congratulations you have successfully installed here tensorflow and uh, you have also installed nvidia to, to toolkit and you have enabled your tensorflow to use a gpu now you can use gpu for a better performance on your deep learning algorithms all right this is all about in this lesson thanks a lot for watching this if you have liked this video please do subscribe this channel and share it with your friends thank you